Hey guys, this will probably be my last slime video, and I know I've I've done quite a few of them lately. But uh, in my first slime video, when I made it with this white Elmer's glue and borax, somebody said that the clear glue actually works better than the white glue. So today I'm going to do that. So I have this red glue. It has some. Uh, it's kind of transparent, and it has some glitter in it. So that'll be interesting. I've already dissolved about a about a teaspoon of borax in a little bit of water, about a third cup of water. I'm going to set that off to the side for the moment. And the first thing I need to do, like in the first video, is empty out the glue. Now I'm going to mix, uh, I'm going to fill these little containers up, try to wash most most of the glue out of it, but it's usually a one-to-one -one mix between water and glue. <clears throat> All right, both of those, both of those in. So I put six ounces of glue. In with six ounces of water. You need to mix it up really well. well I think that's about as good as I'm going to get it. And take the borax water and just slowly add some in. I'm not going to throw it all in this time. Oh yeah, I can feel it. Oh yeah. Oh, that's cool. No, I was just sitting here thinking. I think a blender or something like that would be really useful here. Because I got chunks. I've been working with this for, I don't know, 20, 30 minutes. It's kind of like a bowl of snot with jello in it. I'm trying to crush up all the little pieces of that slime. Stuff is weird. It's like it you can feel it like there's string in it. Like it makes sh little strands of slime. This might be something good for like a uh, Halloween, you know, it's right around the corner. Like a big snot booger. I like it. I'd like to fill a bathtub with this and just sink in it. Now I believe you can keep this stuff for up to two weeks in a Ziploc bag. Keep it in the refrigerator. It will last longer than two weeks, but um, people like to throw it out after two weeks because of, you know, bacteria growth and uh, mold. 
I've added a lot of water in here trying to get it really thin and slimy, but it's a, it's a gob again. And I've been out here for an hour stirring the water into this. Cleanup for this is really easy, especially if it's still gelatinous. So if you drop it in your carpet, you can pick most of it out. And then uh, warm water in a washcloth with some soap and scrub it out. That right there is now 48 ounces of water. I put two 24 ounce pop bottles of water in it. I think this is slime, but it's not. I mean, it's like little little strings. I put white glue in it and I noticed that the white glue almost instantly bonded with all the little strings. You see all the little white strings on my fingers? I want to fill a pool with that. It's going everywhere. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully I'll see you in the next one.